Welcome to Starting From Stretch, No Dog Raised Solar Bread for any legal purposes. This is strictly for historical and educational purposes only. Back to the Woods series, episode 18, part 2, The War Eagle, Harry Hargrove. I remember my first visit to Mr. Hargrove's place. The first dog I saw was a giant rock wild, Harry had. On his first visit, we were there to breed to Hargrove's Hell Bins, aka the Z Dog. Z was an impressive looking dog with a great bill. He was a big, red, red nosed dog, as I remember. Um, Harry asked how the female was bred. I said she was. Uh, triple bred Mims Little Amber, a daughter of Marlowe's Champion Bridges, inbred red boy. Mr. Hargrove was familiar with the Little Amber dogs as he shared with me the story of BDK's Champion Tate, a son of Mims Little Amber, out of a snooty red boy cross. He said Tate was a real good dog with a bite. Harry would tell the story about the Z dog and his loss. He picked Z up against Champion Benny Blanco, a Jeep and Rufus Cross. Harry showed me the She-Willie dog, who is down from BDK's Rennie. Uh, great dog, great producing dog. Uh, Mr. Hargrove would cross. Hargrove's grand champion Rufus to a daughter Finley's champion Bo. Hargrove's Abigail. This cross produced Hargrove's champion crop. From a Bullison bred to a Bo and Bullison bottle with Abigail. Champion crop will be a great champion. Harrow Cross champion crop. to a daughter of Garner's Grand Tammy Spike, bred to a Klaus female, Mickles Maggie May. This breeding produced Hargrove's champion, Little Red. A great dog and producer. On his first visit to Harry's, my kennel partner at the time purchased a male and a female pair that was double bred Hargrove's champion Little Red. They turned out to be some exceptional dogs and good producers. The history. I asked Harry about some of these famous bloodlines and crosses from the past. Uh, Hargrove's champion Pepper was a great dog from a Red Bull Jocko Bully Son Cross. Miss Hargrove also shared with me a story about the Tonka and Rufus dogs, which really, which he did really well with that particular cross. Um, one of the most noted dogs off of that cross was uh, Gator Boys Champion Mickey. A great looking dog and a great producing dog. Another dog I like to mention is Fisher's Champion Whiskey, who was heavily bred on McGee's Panther. As I can remember, 
Harry had his Zebo and Red Bull dog in his yard. He thought a whole lot of. Everybody claimed the Zebo dogs weren't good dogs, but um, they're in a lot of great dogs' pedigrees, to say the least. Is Hagro like the um, Bandit Nigarino cross dogs? It was Wild Size Renegade and his little mate brother, Gunther. They were great dogs and great producers. I remember me and my brother went on a visit to Harris one time and we purchased uh, a male and a female out of Z. I think the male was Z bred to a bull's female, and the female was uh, Z bred to two by two's daughter, crossed with some Rufus, which made it three quarter Tonka Bear and a quarter Rufus. Um, those were some great dogs and excellent producers as well. Uh, Harry had a great understanding about these American people with Terriers. Uh, he's seen a lot, been around a lot. Stay tuned, more to come about the War Eagle and these great American people with Terriers. Starting from stretch.